Do you see my highlight? Wow, on fleek. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I look crazy. So we're starting off this video a little bit weird because um, I'm wearing a wig cap and I don't usually start my videos wearing a wig cap. So yes, the reason why I look crazy and I'm wearing a wig cap is because this video, I'm quite excited to film this video. I feel like this is quite highly anticipated because I've had numerous people ask me if I can film one of these videos and I've just never had not that I've never had the time because I definitely have had the time but <laughs> I, I I don't know I just never got around to filming one of these videos so now I'm here in this video I'm going to be showing you guys my entire wig collection Wow, 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 wow. I have roughly 14 to 16 wigs here, I think. Um, I've left a few out. There's like three that I haven't included in this video, simply because they're costume wigs. They shed everywhere. I don't really want this room to be covered in wigs, hair. Um, that didn't really make sense. We're gonna keep going. I'm doing this in no particular order. We're just gonna jump straight in. All of the wigs are on the floor right now, uh, below me. And I'm just gonna pick them at random and show them to you, put it on, give it a good style, um, tell you what I like and what I don't like about it, where I got it from. Um, I will try my best to link all of these wigs in the description if I can find them. If I cannot, then I greatly apologize, but I will try my best to find links for all these wigs in case you want to go and buy one yourself. I love wigs. I've been wearing wigs for like... How many years? I'm gonna say like two years? Two or three years? Yeah, two or three years. We're gonna, we're gonna go with that. No more rambling. We're just gonna jump straight into it. The first wig that I'm picking up off the floor is this one. Some of these are my mum's, but we kind of just share them because we're like, if you want to wear one of my wigs, then, you know, feel free to do that. A lot of my wigs are from Lush Wigs because they're really nice. They're cheap, but they're really good. And, uh, yeah, I just, I enjoy Lush Wigs wigs a lot. Lush Wigs wigs. <laughs> so this is what it looks like out of the packet. Ta-da! Um, take this little net thing off. If you want me to do, like, an in-depth video on how to look after wigs, how I package them, package? How I keep them, uh, how I wash them and stuff like that, then I can do a video on that too. So yes, this is the wig out of the pack. It's got a scalp here to make it look more realistic, which goes throughout the actual cap itself. It goes through a, a bit of a way, so like you can move the hair and the, the, the um, scalp the fake scalp is still there, it ends about there. So you've got quite a bit of scalp room going on there. Um, I'm pretty sure this one is called Black Tea uh, by Lush Wigs. It's just a short, wavy wig. I don't know the correct way to put on a wig, but I just kind of like plop it on my head and then pull it down at the back. Some people tip their head over and then do it from like back to front or like front to back. I don't really know the correct way to put one on. I just kind of plop it on my head and then see what happens. So here is the first wig. I'm, yeah, as I said, I'm pretty sure this is called Black Tea from Lush Wigs. Um, this is one of my mum's. Just a sh a sh um, <laughs> um, um, I don't really wear this wig, obviously, because it's my mum's. But what I do like about it is the length. I really don't like long wigs that much. You will find out by this video that I do actually have quite a lot of long wigs. But uh, over time I've learned that they're not actually great because um, they tend to shed a lot and they tangle a lot easier. And also they're just a lot harder to maintain than shorter ones. So. Nowadays when I'm buying wigs, I tend to buy ones that are like this length or only a tad bit longer just because I don't really enjoy the way long wigs are. Uh, they're a nightmare to wear, they tend to be heavier and they just, all in all, I don't really like hair in my face. When I did have longer hair, I've got short hair now, like really short, 
but when it was longer I didn't ever like it being in my face and I used to tie it up like every single day until I got a receding hairline really badly and then I was like maybe I should get it cut off so I did anyway <laughs> I don't really like hair in my face so maybe that's why I don't like the longer wigs because they're always and I'm always like oh, get out of my face um but yeah I do prefer the shorter wigs just because they I feel like they look cuter I feel like shorter hair suits me more and I don't know, I like them. I like them, I like them. I'm looking over here, I've got my phone camera here, so my phone is on Snapchat so I can like see the wig and everything. Um, yeah, what I don't really like about it is the fringe. It kind of, it looks choppy and it's just not great. One, one section of it here, don't know if you can see, but it's got a little kink in it. Um, so it's doing the uttermost and it's not good. This one's mine, this is my one. Um, it's a long blonde one. This is what it looks like. Yes, this is what this one looks like out of the bag. It's long, blonde, wavy. This one, once again, this one is from Lush Wigs. Um, I think it's called Callisto, so I'll try and find the link for it, but this is what it looks like. Usually I wear a hat with this one just because the fringe looks really bad. I think that was my fault. I think I tried to like cut it and then... <laughs> made a bit of a bodge off of it. <laughs> I have a really good habit of doing that. This is this one, but do you see what I mean about the fringe? Like, I just don't really know what's going on there. It kind of sticks out really funky. Um, it looks really choppy and it it's like thick, but it's not doing the most because it's just like a tiny triangle here. Um, you can kind of see the wig cap through as well. I don't really know what to do to fix it. So usually with this wig, I put a hat on and I just shove the fringe up into the hat. As you can probably guess, the thing that I don't like about this one is the fringe. Not really sure what she's doing. She's having a great time, but it's not a great time for me because it doesn't look... It doesn't look great. But, um... Obviously I'm not putting these on properly. You can see my hair and everything through that. I'm not like gluing them down or anything. Because this is simply just to show you all my wigs. But yes, what I do like about this wig is the colour. And I love the waviness of it. I don't know if you can really see. Let me try and stand on tiptoes and like... <laughs> yeah, the curls are really nice. And they don't... They haven't... I've worn this wig out. I've worn it to college. And I wore it to an event one time too. Um... And the curls haven't ever gone away. I've never had to recurl it or do anything with it. It's It looks nice. And even out in the wind, it still looks nice. And the curls still look good. So that's definitely a plus. This wig is from Uvimi. Um, this is my only wig from Uvimi. But I do plan to get more because this is my second favourite wig. I have a first favourite and a second favourite. I don't think I have a third favourite yet, but yeah. So this is my second favourite wig in my collection. Love, I love, I love the colour. The colour is so... I love, I love the colour of this wig. It's so nice. So nice. Look at it. I could eat it. Okay, so here is this wig. Um, I absolutely adore this wig. I think it's so cute. It's got the curls in it, like the waves. Um, I've worn this one out as well. I actually wore this to Bournemouth Beach um, and it was super windy. I did wear a hat on top of it but it was really really windy and this wig still looked good by the time I got home so I just, I mean, I just adore it. The colour is so nice. But, do you know what's quirky and cool about this wig? It came with space buns. Oh my god. A lot of you Vimi's wigs do come with, um, like, either space buns or little pigtails you can attach. Um, that are the same colour as the wig, obviously. You can just attach them and then they flow. Um, or you can, you can also get, like, really, really short ones, like, super super short bobs and then a ponytail that attaches at the back so it looks like your hair is pulled back um, but this one came with these little space buns the clips just look like this these are the little space buns you 
you can see the colour a little bit more. That's this one! Love this one, I have nothing at all bad to say about this wig, I love it so much. Um, I would wear it out and I have worn it out multiple times. Love this wig, love the colour, it's really soft, it doesn't shed. Love the space buns, the fringe is good. You can't see the wig cap through the back or anything, you can't see any tracks or anything, so love this wig, thank you UV me very much. I just want to say also, I'm not sponsored at all. I'm not sponsored to say any of this, I bought all of these wigs with my own money. Wig. So that's... Oh, it got stuck in my ear piercing! <laughs> Girl, oh my god. Please, why is it stuck in my board cap now? Oh my god, it's not okay, wow. One is another Lush Wigs one. This is my mum's. Um, I haven't actually ever tried this one on, I don't think, so this is going to be an experiment. It doesn't have one of those fake scalps. I also don't think the fringe has been cut, so we're going to have a good time with this one. Um, so cute though, look how cute that is. Little bob. No one has a forehead that big. Like, no. No one has a forehead like that. So, yeah. This tag is going to get on my nerves, but we're just going to try it on. See how it looks. I've never tried this one on, so I'm kind of scared. Who has a fringe this long? I mean, who? Like, where are you going in life with a fringe like this? I don't understand. <laughs> It's literally so far back. The wig is over here. The start of the wig is back here. This is actually really cute. I love a bob, to be honest. I'm thinking about buying a bob wig next. Shall I? Look how cute this is. I'm not sure why it's doing that. I'd probably give that a little bit of a straighten. Because the other side isn't doing that, so I'm not sure why this side is. But oh my god, look how cute that! Oh! Oh my god, I high key love it! Oh wow, wait, it's grey though! Can I work with grey? No, it doesn't really suit me. The style though, the style, this bob, I think really does suit me. Maybe I will go for a bob next. Of the bob style of it, I really do. I think it looks good on me. I was expecting it not to suit me at all, but I kind of like it. I've never had a bob style wig before, not like this. Like, I've had the wavy ones that are short, but I've never had a dead straight bob like this. And to be honest, I really like it. This is one of Lush Wig's new, new wigs that they brought out. Um, they recently brought out a ton of new wigs and this was one of them. This is my favorite wig. My favourite wig ever. I don't think I will ever find a wig that I love as much as this. I absolutely adore this wig so much. I've put it up in one of these little things just because the front pieces curl and they really get on my tits. Like, not just on my physical tits, but it gets on my nerves that they curl and flick in my face. And I'm like constantly trying to move them out of my way, so I just put them back. Um, but yes, it's this half and half, half black half like dusty rose oh, the colors i mean can we just oh my god it's gorgeous i love it so much look y'all at this wig i mean oh, it's so nice i love it so much um it's got a little flick to it at the ends, the ends have been like, I think they've been like curled up with a straightener sort of thing. Um, yeah, they've got a little flick about them. I adore this wig so much. There is nothing bad I can say about this wig either. It's, it's so soft, really, really soft. Um, it does shed a little bit. I think the black side sheds more than the pink side. Don't know why, kind of weird, but it does shed a little bit. I don't know whether it just needs a wash or needs more of a thorough brush because I haven't really brushed it thoroughly. I'm going to leave this video here all of a sudden. I was going to film all of them today but I it's getting kind of late. It's like 
um, 1.45 in the afternoon. I haven't eaten lunch yet and I also have another video to film this afternoon and I also need to go and do my horses. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a huge thumbs up so that I know you've enjoyed it. My social medias will all be linked in the description box below so if you'd like to head over and follow them then of course you can. Please do subscribe to this channel to see more content like this because I love wigs. I'll probably be ordering more of them so if you'd like me to do an unboxing or a review of any wig website that you're curious about then do let me know and I can definitely do that. If you have any questions also about any of my wigs or how I look after them or what I do with them, how I keep them and then do just let me know that as well and I can either make a separate video or I'll just respond to your comment and let you know the answer. That's all for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. If you're still watching this, you've come a long way with me. Thank you very much. <laughs> Once again, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Remember to stay positive, keep smiling, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!